Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Nogat21, welcome back to Let's Play Soul Reaver 2. In the last episode, bleh, we start to explore this hellish world that Mobi Mobius has sent us to. He sent us 30 years into the future because he's a prick. Fantastic. On the plus side, we found Ustenheim and Janos Aldrin's personal uh, sanctuary, only it's in ruins. We also found the, uh, hang on a minute. You mother! Come here, you son of a bitch. I'm trying to do a fucking intro, and what do I do? I get attacked by dogs. Anyway, as I was saying, map. We start to explore our way through the past, I mean future. Found Ushenheim, found Yanis Ordrin's place, it's in ruins. We also found the next forge, the Air Forge, which will hopefully give us an ability to access the time streaming device that's in the uh, Termagant Swamp and head back to the past. Here's hoping we can actually do that. Nah, I don't really need to fuck with you guys, so piss off. <sighs> I had to crawl all the way back to Ustenheim to save, which is annoying. <sighs> is that dog gonna keep chasing me? No, it stops, alright. I'm still curious about what's up there. Ow. Would you lot? God damn pricks. I'm just trying to go somewhere. Fuck off. I'll get the air reaver first before I actually see if that's actually anything substantial or if it's just something that's going to become uh, apparent in the past. You know, I am just running through trying to get somewhere. You don't need to try to kill me. I mean, I understand the reason why I look like a monster, but come on. Can't you fuckers decide something better to do? Let's see. Alright, I'm gonna go this way. Hell you. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, I still have the Darkness Reaper activated. Oh yeah, that's because I didn't go into the Spectral Realm. Hello, demons. Goodbye, demons. Fuck you. Plus side, I don't have to deal with any scripted shit. I think. If demons spawn in front of the goddamn eyeball over here, I'm gonna be pissed. Or annoyed, at the very least. No? Alright. Yeah, wait a minute. <laughs> they despawned. Oh wait, no they didn't. Right there. Okay, how'd that miss? Screw you guys. Whoop. Back away from the eyeball. God damn it. Yeah, you better roll back up in the head. Okay. Now back to our regularly scheduled programming of platforming and puzzle solving to get another upgrade for the Reaver. Okay, now the question is... Oh, now that's fitting. <laughs> Talk about Vortex of, tor of the Eye of the Storm. Neat. Okay, then. I was gonna say, there's no way it's that easy. Hmm. 
Okay, there's the symbol. Alright, let's see here. Uh, I see a lot. I see crystals that I could interact with if I had the Light Reaver, but I don't have the Light Reaver. I'm guessing I need to do something here. Looks like I need to gain access to the Light Reaver to activate that, which will probably open up that door over there, or do something that will allow me to gain entrance. And there's the font. And there's an asshole. Get out of my face. Give me the power of light. Alright. Okay. Light shined on. Now what? Cool. Let's see. Is it is it easy as it would help if I didn't actually fuck that up, but I need to be in spectral for that, don't I? But first things first, let me try... Okay, that does nothing. I thought it did for a second. Because, you know, gemstones plus light equals switch. Alright, well... That's obviously a gate I can't access it physically. What about the spectral? Nailed it. T pose the way to victory. You know what would be nice? If, because we're in the uh, spectral realm, kills with the Reaver actually automatically absorb the souls of the enemies and actually heals you. Kind of like how it functions in the physical realm, only instead of, you know, not healing the body we inhabit. It actually heals us. Well, that's just wishful thinking on my part. Considering the Reavers are default weapon. Did you just come out of the walls? Ow. Seriously, did you fuckers just pop out of the walls? Sorry, pal. I'm not fucking with you. Piss off. Alright. God damn it. I was taking a drink, you fucks. Nice try. God damn it, I was taking a drink, you assholes. Hear them? Take the emblem shield, place it in the uh, proper hole and orientation, and Bob's your uncle, Bucky's your aunt, and we're in. Let's see, at least I think. I need to activate both statues so they shine their respective elements onto this pillar here. Which should open the pillar and give me access to the uh, forge. Because I think we I finally see what this is for. This is for the wind. Well, technically, the air reaver. It's probably going to give me increased jumping capabilities or something. That's going to do something. Ah. Geronimo! Okay, let's get the fonts acted. activated. Okay. Let's 
see, there's the picture of the Reaver. There's the picture of the light. And over here's the picture of darkness. Let's do darkness first. Now, do I go up or do I go down? Well, what's up here? First. Oh, hello. Big boy. You look different. That did something. Hello, Axe. Ow! Oh, we got proper enemies. I got a weird weapon that I don't know how to use. Strategy stays the same. Give me toss this. Give me the sword. shield. Oh, I see more enemies ahead. Let's go see. Where'd my weapon go? Come here. Hole. Can't you tell that you're not supposed to attack me while I'm attacking someone else? Don't you know the proper etiquette of combat? Don't you know this is one-on-one -on -one sort of fighting? Not me random melee garbage you can't keep track of because the combat system is trash. Insert every single Elder Scrolls game. Could you not do the cutscenes until after I'm finished with battle? I would appreciate it. Of course, I'm probably gonna get zapped by that stupid eyeball by accident. Oh, sure, you don't zap the enemies. I see how it is. Sword, I don't need you. Piss off, eyeball. Okay, I need to make a platform that I can use to stab the blade into that door. easy. Okay, so I need the darkness to gain access to the light. This seems to be unnecessary. 
Okay. Now I have the light reaver. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? Like that's actually anywhere to go exactly. Nothing. All right. Yes, you're scary. I know. Oh, that's annoying. Then why give me the light reaver? I'm confused. Okay, so I need the darkness reaver to. Oh, I get... okay. I see what's going on here. I need the dark. What the hell? What just? Okay, that. Let me try. That's interesting. Air currents. That'll affect my gliding right here. Okay, so grab the darkness. Ah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We activate the bridge. Aha! Oh, fuck me, it's a time puzzle! Son of a bitch. Well, this is a pickle. Oh god. Question is, how long does this last? Hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna have to book it like mad. If this is actually what I'm, what I'm supposed to. Okay, stab this. Get down here. Grab this. Yeah, there's no way. Why don't I do this? Everyone's supposed to Did I try to shoot you? No, okay. Well, Alright then. This provides me a pickle. Hmm. The thing is, the bridge, the shut, the darkness bridge doesn't last long enough for me to actually do anything. Yeah, I can get up, the, I can get to there, but without the light reaver, it's pointless. Unless, get the fuck out of my face. Okay, I'm about to do something very stupid. Okay, don't do that. Oh, I don't like doing that. 
That par that scares the fuck out of me. Hmm. There must be some other way for me to get here. I mean, if I can get on that, that's not a problem. Okay. Oh! Would you kindly piss off? Stupid eyeball. Wait a minute. Aha! The bridge is the answer. I got it now. I see it. Okay. Knock that fucker out. Get the Light Reaver. Head on back before that fucker wakes up. Get onto this room up. Alley oop. And then shoot this. Okay, and we have a crystal. I'm guessing we go back to the center room and uh, place it. It's bleeding. This crystal is bleeding orange. Okay. I guess it's a good thing I killed everyone I came across. Okay, so I take this back here and I put it somewhere? Orange crystal. Ah, I see. These are where the crystal down is where the crystals go. Up is where I get the crystals. Got it. I guess it's also a heart. Fair enough. We gonna eat it? I guess that's one air vent taken care of. Two to go. Oh, you can't make me run faster out of here. Damn it. I can fly somewhat. Oh, I get it. The hearts activate gusts of wind, which allow me to push up. Interesting. Okay, might as well go up this one now, I guess. And it's going to be the opposite. I bet it's going to be the opposite of what the darkness one was. I don't know why the screen suddenly turned red or orange. That's not a good sign.
Okay, now for you. And off of you. Yeah, I wish there was an easier way to dump weapons in this. Weapon. Let me guess, it's a similar situation as before. Yep, pretty much. Only this time I need to get the darkness up there. Okay, now I need to figure out where I'm supposed to jump. Over here a bit. Alright. Is there a way for me to turn off the air bellows? I bet there isn't, but it doesn't hurt to check. Also, it doesn't hurt the help that these fuckers are here. Unless... I have to try the spectral realm. Let's try the spectral realm. Ah, because air has no... <sighs> heft in the spectral realm. Same thing as water. It doesn't exist. So I can just flap my wings over here. Oh. It might help if I was actually at full health to do that. Ow. I probably should have came to the light puzzle this room first. How are you not dead, sir? Okay, jump. Jump. Let's get back to the bridge. Jump on over. It's completely unnecessary, and there's no walls here. Realm, tell these fuckers to kiss right off. Unfortunately, you fuckers don't have souls, so. Easy! Okay, we have a bridge. Even tells me to go spectral. Okay, I have a bridge. It looks to be permanent. Wait, yep, okay. Let me just double check. Alright. Easy. I actually, you know, fly across. And let there be light. There's the green heart. Now the only one left is the blue. Oh, it even, even pumps. Nice. Okay, okay, looks like I'm not going back there anytime soon. 
Whee! And now let's just go into the room with the reaver on it. Once that's done, I should have access to the air reaver. Keyword should. this time. Wow, that just sucks. Although it makes you wonder how all this air is actually coming through this place. Alright, now the only thing left is the reaper. Because I doubt this is actually enough wind to push me up all the way to the top. I'm gonna guess this one is just physical and spectral realm based. Come on, bitches. Show me what you got. Oh, great. These are easy punks. I say that and I'm getting hit. Alright, put the key into the switch, open up the doors, and now puzzle room. Seriously, only one place of this was uh, challenging. I say that, and I still need the Light Reaver to get up there. I mean, to open, activate the switch. Oh gee, a giant empty room with nothing for me to jump on, and a symbol that tells me to go into the spectral. I wonder, what should I do? Easy! Man, I suck at doing charge attacks. Why is it when I fight the fucking Slua, Slua here? I don't have that much of a problem. But when it comes to human humanoid enemies, they kick my ass. All of your souls belong to me. I jump. Well, good news. I'm on the second floor. Bad news is, I lost my Reaver Enhancement. But there's one right here. Me suggesting I need darkness first, then light. Because it looks like I need a darkness to activate that bridge. Hello. Set. Yep, I need darkness first. Whee! At least it's actually nice enough to actually push me all the way over here and I don't need to go into the spectral room again. Well, the few enemies I can actually use the Reaver's heavy attacks not get immediately get hit in the face. Okay, is there going to be an eyeball up here for me to do? stupid of me. Hang on a minute. Oh wait, that's just statue architecture, right? Yeah, it is. Hmm. Well, okay then. Ooh! Okay, I did things. I did bet the things backwards. Got it. Okay, so spectral realm. 
Fuck you guys. Draw the souls over. Physical realm. I see what I need to do. Light? Flap on over here. I seriously fucked that up. I seriously fucked that up. Why do I have to lose so much fucking health on coming back to the spectral realms? Would you fuckers get out of my way, you worthless pieces of shit? Oi, oi. Okay. Apparently I got blown off course by my own stupidity. Light Reaver. Let's try this again. Don't turn. Don't activate the Dark Reaver. That's what you did stupidly the first time. Instead, go up the stairs, activate the door. Okay. Ignore that fat bastard. Jump over here. No, wait. Hang on a fucking minute. Okay, yeah, I get over there, but... Does the door not stay open? No, it doesn't. Then how in the balls? Okay, let me think. I have the Light Reaver. I can open up the door. How long does this stay open? All as to the Dark Reaver. No, wait. It closes when I leave the room. Oh. Okay, so this is a little more tricky then. I see. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. The thing is, I need the Darkness Reaver to destroy that fucking eyeball and open that. But I can't do that because I need the Light Reaver to open up this goddamn door. Unless... Oh. Asshole, you opened up already. Game, I see what you want me to do, but the problem is the fonts are on the wrong fucking side. Unless there's a way to shut that off.
Too bad I can't pull that down. What am I missing? Oh, this is annoying. Okay, light reaver to open up this. But I need the dark reaver for these two pieces of shit. As I get close, this bastard's just gonna zap me and kill me. Which in that case just leads me back to here, and it's a fucking circle. Yeah, yeah, zap me all you want, it's not gonna do you any good. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. There's two portals on each side. But wait, that shouldn't be. <clears throat> oh boy, what am I missing that's obvious to this puzzle? Hang on a minute. I can move this. Wait a second. If I can move that by some description, I should be able to move this one too. Oh, I feel like a dumbass. I was wondering because that those have handlebars that look like they should be able to interact with them. But, like an idiot, I didn't think to actually, you know, check. Oh, that's stupid of me. Okay. Ah. Then again, the simplest solution is the easiest and most obvious of the solutions. Man, I make things way too hard on myself sometimes. I overthink problems that are very easily solved. Don't tell me this bridge goes out. Because if it does, I'm going to be really annoyed. Alright. So long as that bridge stays there, we'll be fine. But if it doesn't, I'm going to be a bit pissed off. Okay. Activate this br air bridge now. Break on through to the other side. Open up that door. Run across the bridge. Get the crystal. And get the fuck out of here. It's a heart, not... It's a crystal heart. There we go. That's what it is. It's a cr goddamn crystal heart. Okay, walk on the bridge of shadows. I don't understand how we're able to do so, but okay. Oh boy. Makes me wonder who the sad mummified corpse is. You know, now I think about this, architecture reminds me of something. Is it ancient, uh, Mayan, Aztec? Well, look, some of it looks like it's ancient Central American architecture. And some of it looks different. Hmm. Okay, now to the blue room. 
And this will just shoot me straight up to the reaver, right? Hopefully it does. And hopefully the game doesn't crash. Because I read someone I read while I was trying to figure out how to make this fuck this shit work. But they ended up crashing here. Here's hoping I don't have a crash and have to redo this entire fucking section over again. I'm gonna be real pissed if I do. I mean I could run back to Ustenheim and save, but that's an annoying run back. <sighs> The downside of having save points instead of, you know, save wherever you want and auto saves. Okay. Whee! Well, I'm up here now. Oh, we blow light on the light, and darkness on the dark. Easy enough. Now let's just fly our way into the sky. Not jump off like a dipshit. Fall off. This case may be. Although I wonder what electricity has to do with the air, but okay. As the Reaver drained the forge of its vital energy, the Tempest receded. I recovered myself, and paused to admire my newly forged weapon, now imbued with the elemental power of air. Thus armed, I hope that I now finally possess the means to escape this wasted land. Alright, health increase and we now have the Air Reaver. And it looks like no crashing. Good. Oh, so that's what these are for. Is this gonna... Eh. Whee! Okay. What? Da, 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 da. Wait, what? Hold auto face to glide straight up. What do you mean hold auto face? That's not how it works. Ooh. We can now destroy walls. I think. Why are you giving me an auto save? Okay, let's see what this baby can do. Okay, that's a powerful gust this of wind. elemental reaver I discovered had the power to obliterate barriers that were cracked or compromised. 
At last, I had the means to open that ruined time-streaming chamber I discovered so long ago in the swamp. Now, perhaps, I could leave this wasteland and return to an era when Janos Ordrin still lived. Well, okay then. Let's head back to Ustenheim. And take a save. And call the day. Open sesame. Attack. Oh, hey, guys. You can all just fuck off. I got better shit to do than worry about your sorry asses. Get you later, shit lords. Ow. Bitch, you're lucky I don't need to be at full health for the reaver to do anything. Hope you bastards can swim. Oh, you can't? Aw, oh, shame. Otherwise, you might be able to, to try and catch me if you could, and I fucking swore I pressed the button, and I fucking did it. Fantastic. Then again, I think I probably need to either replace the membranes or the buttons on this PS3 controller. It's getting a little on the old side. So I probably need to get this replaced or tune it up a bit. Probably both, actually. Fuck off. Hunters, you got demons to worry about. I mean, I honestly should see what that is, but I'm going to ignore it. And oh my god. Wow, I'm being hunted like crazy. Man, the demons are really pissed. They do not want me to leave. Y'all can fuck off. Oh, great, you bastards. Close the gates on me. Shoot. Okay, bastards. Nice try, dickhead. Your soul is mine, Shing Sun style. <sighs> Gotta wait for that gate. Thanks, I need to get back in here anyway. You dick. You know, how is it you bastards hit me when I'm running? Have I mentioned I hate these guys? Stop trying to stab me, you piece of human garbage. How do you like getting stabbed, huh? How do you like it, you piece of fuck? Get impaled, son of a bitch. Oh, you want some too, you stupid mutt? Stupid dog. I just want to fucking save. And you're also getting in my way. Fine. Your life is forfeit. I will devour your soul, and you will never know eternal rest. This piece of human garbage. Huh. All because I want to fucking save. Game saved. Oh, fuck. Whew. Well then, I think that's enough for today. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been NoGod21. This has been Let's Play Soul Reaver 2. In the next episode, we're going to head back to Termigan Swamp, bust into the time streaming chamber, and head back to the past where Janos Ordrin is still alive. 500 years ago.
over 500 at this point, but semantics. But until then, thanks for watching. Have a wonderful evening, and I'll see you all next time.